First you cut off the head, and then you wait for all the blood to dry now. The unspeakable has happened. That's not my concern. policeman arrested Mr. Darwin and carried him away as if he were nothing but a common criminal. That policeman, he is corrupt to the bones, I'm sure of it. I do so fear for Mr. Darwin's safety. Miss Nightingale, do you know where they might have gone? But the policeman, he did mention a funeral. I believe I know where it is. Follow me. Poor Mr. Darwin has been through so much recently. Those people are trying to discredit a lifetime of work. It's disgraceful. And I fear Mr. Darwin is no longer the fit young man who once traveled the world. Here we are. The obsequies are taking place here. Better hurry now. You can find me here afterwards. That's it. I don't want to hurt you. Oi, what are you doing? Walk. Ah, oh, there's no need for such brutality. What do you want from me? I need you to be honest with a friend of mine. Oh, you're a brash one, aren't you? Desperate times call for desperate measures. Mine eye shall behold and not another, though my reins be consumed within me. Resurrection and the life. He that believeth in me, though he were dead, yet shall he live. Move along, you silly move. You two win this round. She's our queen. You must respect her. He was always This is the culprit. I was just carrying out my orders. Arresting an old man and dragging him off to Lord knows where is fine work indeed for a policeman. Now, sir, tell us where you have taken Mr. Darwin. A man paid me to bring him to his secret base. How terrible. We will need transportation. Shall we? Darwin 
until I've seen to his wounds. They're here! Attack! Enforcement here! Ah. We're here to fight! You've no we'll chance! This You'll be sorry! Oh. Here we go! Mr. Darwin's condition is stable. You may move him now. Please look after him, Miss Nightingale. My brother and I will visit soon. Look who's here. We were very worried about you, sir. You're looking spry for a fossil, sir. A man's friends are the best measure of his worth. I'm proud to count you among mine. The dangers pass us. No need to leave, sir. What Mr. Darwin needs now is rest. To that end, he's joining his family on the Isle of Wight. Rest, indeed. I shall start work on my next book. I must insist that you recuperate quietly, sir. The acquisition of knowledge is in itself sufficiently recuperative. Go, tell her. This is one fight I aim to avoid, sir. Thank you for everything, my friends. Ideas, like people, can only thrive when they are free. Oh. 